come you're so late? <sighs> I'm late because the train was delayed. Hey, I thought my brother was picking me up. Oh, he had a match today. He told me to pick you up. You're kidding! He's fighting again? <sighs> you guys are too much. So where's he fighting now? At the old gym. Don't blame him. He wins every fight he's in. Leave him alone. What good's winning? He's practiced for ten years just so he can fight in front of a crowd. Don't talk about it. Got what I told you to bring? With me, you don't have to worry. Your family's precious goods are safe, okay? Did Customs look at it? Silly. Whenever I go through Customs, nobody checks me out. Where is it? Why the hell are you so anxious? It's in the bag. Oh. So, see if it's broken. <laughs> it's not. Right, then hurry up, because I want to see my brother. Okay, hey, just wait for me. What's the rush? Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Nerd. Sammy, move it! Coming, coming! Funerary plaque. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Full of rotten luck. Get in there. Damn it. Huh? Huh? He wouldn't come back to haunt me, would he? Oh. <laughs> My friend, I'm sorry. Again, you're really nuts. Mm -hmm. So, Joan, you're back. You know me. Hands get bored. Just this one. Mm. Well, dear mother wants to see you. Joan! All right, I'll go see her after this fight. Hey, get changed. Don't just stand there. Sister, relax. It'll be a quick match, hmm? <laughs> yeah, get changed. Uh. Have a seat. Go on. Michael, what's up? You look nice and fit. What we talked about? Thought about it? Mr. Wong, I've lost to opponents, but never to money. No go. Well, see you in the ring. Good luck. Michael, who is that guy? He's a clown. Forget him. In a sec, I'll knock him out for you, okay? Sure, he'll probably knock your lights out. Give me five. This guy's mine. Be careful. Yeah, careful you don't get wet. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Little bastard. No good rubbish. Oh, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, coming out now, weighing in at 170 pounds, a heavyweight boxer from the Iron Fist Club, Mr. Billy Chow. His opponent, weighing 165 pounds, a heavyweight boxer of the Dragon Fist Club, Mr. Michael Lee.
Break. 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 to
anymore. Yeah, I'll knock him out. Good. Stay in close now. If you're so far back, how can you punch, huh? Be sure you remember well, that. Do it, huh? Put it on. All right. Hey, miss, finally I found you. What is it? What is it? You guys, I just can't believe you left this behind. Lucky I heard you say you were coming here. Here, take it. Well, I... Uh, no need to thank me. My name is Tommy. Oh, yeah, I overheard you say your brother was a boxer. So who is he? Do I know him? I box myself. His name is Michael Lee. He's really a... Oh! Ah, sure. I know him. Mikey. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> well, he does hit pretty hard and he is pretty fast, but he doesn't have that much experience. I haven't boxed him yet. You know, we're in different categories. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. I was just watching him out there a while ago, and uh, he didn't look that good. Really getting beaten up. What? My reward for being nice. This must be worth a lot. Bingo. anymore. Come on, let it go, Michael. Huh? Just let it go. Stop! <laughs> Michael, let's throw in the towel. We can always fight next time. Don't throw in the towel. Alan, I'd much rather die. I don't want to give up. <laughs> Bet on the guy. 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 Bet on
wash my eyes out. They burn. Sure. the wrong thing again. Lee, it's hard to believe he passed away so soon. <laughs> I found this chain in the locker room that day. I think that it's uh, Michael's. <sighs> Actually, I was going to give it to you earlier, but I figured that you're busy. Therefore, hey. I... Uh, How did you know the necklace is Michael's? Uh, uh, it's got a picture of Michael in it. Uh, uh, Miss Lee's in there, too. Oh. You've got pretty good eyes. How old was he in the picture? And how old was Miss Lee? We were all pretty young back then. We all grew up together, you know. Huh. You grew up together. Uh, how long did you know Michael? More than ten years. Hey, Sammy, don't talk to him like that. He was just being nice. Being yeah. nice? Hey, help me out. Yeah, he only lived here seven years. But yeah, but grew up together. 
Over 10 years? Huh. You're full of shit! Hey, 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 hey. What do you mean by all this? Hey, Miss Lee, so what does he mean, huh? I think you know exactly what I mean. Huh? Sammy, don't be like that. Remember when you lost the funerary plaque? Well, he's the guy that brought it uh, back to you. Oh, yeah, that's that right. was him. Well, yeah, oh, you don't know what you're talking stolen. about. And you, you keep out of this. Necklace too. Right 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 I don't believe you. Why are you arguing with me? I'm the guy that brought it back, back, back to you. Things from no, us. you don't appreciate yeah. nothing. What are you doing? You're disgraceful. 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 You're who cares what happened? He brought them both back, so will you forget about it? I don't right. mind. I brought it up with his back. I brought it all what back. Are you to you? What do you think I'm bigger than you? I'll hit yeah, you yeah, a little yeah. squirt. Yeah, yeah sure can. can. But, uh, Miss Lee, I was nice hey. enough to bring it back to you. What do you want? If you got the ball, stay. But I'll cut him off. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, Miss Lee, Miss Lee, listen to me. I really came here to see. Uh, calm down. What are you doing? Hey, calm down. Hey, you little dwarf! If you weren't still in mourning, then I would... Oh, boy. <coughs> you big shit! If I get Come a hold on, of you, I'll calm make you down. a dwarf! Come on, get inside! Come on, what's all the fuss about? What are you, crazy or something? Were you really gonna chop him to death? Of course I was! He asked for it! I went to all the trouble of getting my dad's funerary plaque from China. Then just as soon as I set it down, that bastard picked it up! Good. Come on, I'm gonna kill him! Don't chop him up, come on. If you kill him, you won't have to go tonight. Is it time? I'll get him later. Alan? Alan, where are you going? Joan, Alan and I need to go out for a while. Be back later. Alan, let's go. Let's go now. You're not going to fight, are you? You're still going to fight? Didn't you see my brother's last fight? But, Joan, he can make a whole lot of money on this one, huh? Oh, and just how much? Ten grand wins. Hmm. And what if he loses? Thirty grand if he loses. Oh. You're fighting a fixed match? I don't get it! What have you learned from Michael over the years? Fixed match? How can you do that? It's just I... Uh... Speak up! Come on! Come on, Alan. Say it. I, I really hey, if you won't say it. it, I'll say it. If you wait for Alan, you won't hear why until the next century. Michael had more debt than he could handle. This gym, you're no debt paid for six months. Here, these are all letters from the bank. Take a look at these. If we don't pay soon, the bank gets us. That's right. Alan is crazy. He goes and gets beat up just for the money for the gym. We have no other way to get the money. If we don't do this, tell me, what else can we do, huh? You think that's wrong? Ha! Huh. If that's wrong, then what's right? Tell me! Huh? Let's go, Alan. Let's go and fight. It'd be wrong if you didn't fight, you know. You've got a contract. Let's go. Come on. Disqualified, you try that again. <laughs> 
Want the money? <sighs> Play it smart. Drink this herbal tea. I'll go and get you some rubbing oil for those bruises. Hey. Those bruises of yours won't hurt in a moment. I think three's gonna be a crowd here. Bye-bye. Miss Lee. Hi. You again. Yeah. Uh, Miss Lee. I, um, yeah. What I, is it? Uh, it's okay. Speak up. Uh, it's like this. You see, I, uh... <gasps> hey, you! Hold it! Hold it! Stop running! Come back here! You bastard! <laughs> God damn it! Hey, kid! Skipping school and stealing things, huh? <laughs> hey, you! Give it here! Just take a good look at yourself, would you? Short and stubby and you steal. I'm in a good mood today, so go on. Huh? Hey, brother. That's not fair. We should split it two ways. Share? Share my mother? Get going. Go on. Go on. Hey. Hey, Miss Lee, got it back. See if anything's gone. Thank you very much. That's no problem. What did you want to tell me? Uh, well, I wanted to tell you. Your brother's chain, I, I didn't take it. I'm not sure just how you ended up with my brother's necklace, but when you gave it back to me, I was very grateful. Oh, you're too kind. <laughs> oh, and yes, my name's Joan. Oh. 
Joan. <laughs> Sammy can be a little difficult at times, but both he and Alan are really very nice. Uh, you mean the dwarf? Well, I'll forgive him just because you're so nice. All right. Hey, boss, is that them? That's right. That's them. I'll sidetrack them. Just run away. Oh, so you think you're a big guy now, huh? Ah. Oh. <laughs> the girl's got the wallet! Get that guy! After him! Get that guy! Come on! This way! Get him! Come on! for my sweater, but I won't. Do we still fight or not? Huh? Oh, 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 how do you find me here? Hey, you all right? Oh, oh I'm fine. Uh, and you? Are you all right? I'm all right. Boy, uh, you're hurt. We better take a look at that. Uh, no need. Just a couple of scratches. I fought more than ten guys, you see, but I've got a lot of experience with these Over things. Over ten guys? Yeah. Sure. I'm, I'm really wow. something, you know. Oh, uh, look at me back. Oh. Uh, but I beat them. I beat them good. But I went easy on them towards the end, you know. Oh. Healing up? Yeah, thanks. Good. Joan. Hey, Joan, what happened? Why do you look like that? Are you all right? Hi, guys. Yeah, I'm fine. Why don't you take a seat? I'll go find you some medicine. All right. <clears throat> wow. Why'd you let anybody beat you out like that? You're supposed to hit back, you know. Wow, look at your face. You can't laugh anymore. Both of you guys look just exactly the same. Take a look. Oh. Oh. Shit. I wasn't even talking to you. Hey, Alan. This is because I was fighting uh, over ten guys. How many guys did you fight to get beaten up like that? I thought you were supposed to be really hey. good. Uh, hey. What? What's he doing? What do you want? You're crazy. Are you leaving? You're going to leave? I'll chop you. I really will. Get out of here! I'm going! Sammy! Huh? Uh, something came up, so he had to leave. He left? Uh, isn't that right, Alan? Huh? Yeah, he's nodding. 
Okay. Miss Lee, after so many treatments, how come it hasn't completely healed? It's your tendons. They take a while to heal. Not so. Your brother could always cure me in two treatments. Hmm. That day when he died. Oh. <laughs> hey, sorry, everybody. Uh -huh. Sorry. Hi. I'm a little bit late. Well, Joey, happy birthday. Billy, if you didn't screw around, you'd die. Hey, Joey, they're just regular friends, that's all. Since today's your birthday, I brought them along to celebrate, huh? That right? Hmm. You're not worried about your cousin? Today's your birthday. There's no need to get mad. You're too much. You know I don't like your playboy ways, yet you flout girls in front of me. He'll send you to Thailand for training. If you screw around so much, you'll have no strength. That's no problem. I could go to Thailand right now. Right. Go screw around. Hey, listen, Joey. Don't worry. When I go, I'll concentrate on training. Hmm? What is it? Oh! <laughs> Let them go. Wong, I'm Michael Lee's sister. Just now, I proved to you all that I'm good enough to challenge you to a match. 300 thou. I challenge you to a match for 300 thou. Miss Lee, sit down and talk. There's no need. Miss Lee, your brother's death was just an accident. Nevertheless, the sport has lost a good man. It's a terrible loss. Your brother's loss has been hard on you. I think it's made you unstable. You want to challenge me? Even if you are up to it. So what? The Hong Kong government doesn't allow women to fight men. Am I right? <laughs> hey, miss. It's Mr. Wong's birthday. Get going, huh? Mr. Wong, if I hadn't checked carefully first, I wouldn't have come here. I know you hold underground matches. The government doesn't have to know about this one, does it? Push it. That's it. Come on, come on, come on. One more. That's it. Joan, where have you been? In order to save the flat, I have challenged Mr. Wong. I'm going to fight that boxer of his for $300,000. Help me train. You don't have to. If it's for money, I can fight. I've completely recovered. You can ask Sammy if you don't believe There's me. There's nothing you can say. I've already decided. But I can fight. I need to change. 
Sammy, why didn't you say anything? I can't talk. What do we do? Don't you worry. When she comes out to train, I'll quickly twist the pad. When she kicks, she will twist her ankle. And you see, she'll be hurt for a couple of weeks. How can she fight then? Mm, that's no good. What if she gets seriously hurt? It's no good? No good. Well, you think of something. Joan, let's get started. You'll hold the pad? Yeah. Alan doesn't want to. Uh, uh, he hasn't recovered. He's afraid you'll hurt him. So I'll hold the pad. Okay, come on. Ready? <laughs> Sammy, not bad. Can I kick harder? Sure. <laughs> Sammy, are you okay? Oh, you're not heavy enough for me. Oh, it's all right. I'll practice alone then, okay? Hey, what's going on? Wow, pad training. Can you handle it? All right, then you hold it. You want me to? Hmm. Okay. Sure. Let's go. Come on! Okay, get ready. <laughs> hey, hey, <laughs> hold it! Hey, hey, hold it, will you? Uh, uh, we can do it tomorrow morning. Okay, I've got to go now. Okay, well, if you got to go, you got to go. Tomorrow morning? <coughs> oh, I can't. I'm busy then. How about then, uh, I'll give you a call tomorrow? Uh, how come you're practicing all of a sudden? <sighs> I have a match. You know the guy who killed my brother? It's an underground match. You should come. You're kidding. You're gonna fight that man? Yes. You're really gonna fight Billy Chow? Why did you talk her out of she it? She won't listen to anything I say. Hey, hey, hold it. Hey, hold it. Just hold on. You're gonna fight that guy? I have already agreed. It's all fixed. These guys are dirty. You can't compete with them. I've seen all the dirty tricks. For instance, the last time... Hey, hey, hey. Say no more, right? You know, I just... Uh... I've made up my mind. Fine. <laughs> Just having fun. Oh. Don't do that. Hey. Hi. <laughs> Is Joan here? Huh. You're not afraid I'll chop you all up? What do you want? <laughs> Save your breath, you midget. I came prepared today. See? Oh. Ooh. You call that a knife? Then what do you call this? Hey, calm down. You really want to kill him? What, are you related? I guess you're right. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, you dwarf, I'll get you next time. You're really crazy, you know, you're crazy. You're totally nuts.
Well, hi. Where are you heading? How come you're here? Oh, I was just passing by, that's all. It's a coincidence I ran into you. Oh, just passing by. <laughs> yeah. What a coincidence. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, don't let me bother you. Okay. Uh, see you later. Bye. <laughs> Bye. What? Uh, it's just that you've lost some weight, I think. You've noticed. Yeah, I've been training every day, working out, lost a little weight. Oh, well, that makes sense. It takes a lot to work out. Mm hmm Hey, Joan, there's a good restaurant nearby, and the cook there makes really great steaks. They're really, really good. Hey, he's turned oh, yeah? down off of some big hotels. Uh, uh-huh. How about we go there and try it out? Mm. Mm. I'd really like to take you. Mm. It'll be fun. Mm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Atmosphere's not bad. Mm, I guess. Hey, Jimmy. Jimmy, come on. Two more dailies. Go ahead. Take these. Table number three. Okay. Hair clean. Oh. <laughs> and napkins, please. <clears throat> Thank you. Let's see. It's good. It doesn't really look too good, does it? And the atmosphere seems kind of cheap. <laughs> Hmm. See, John, I didn't think that you would come with me, so I lied about this place. But then you said you'd come. I don't really know the cook, and I've never eaten here before. I thought that, well... Some meals are good, some meals are bad. Let's eat. <laughs> yeah, eat. What is it? Uh, it's nothing. Nothing at all. Hey, Joan. Uh -huh. I see one of my friends over there. I'm going to talk to him. Just wait here. I'll be right back. Alan? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're back. Come and eat. I'm really sorry. I forgot to call and tell you. I've eaten. Uh, that's okay. I'll eat alone. Hey, Joan. So you came back here. I didn't know where you ran off to. I was worried about you. <clears throat> hey, Joan. Uh, what are you doing? I told you to wait for me. Why did you run off? I was worried something happened to you. I know what you've been doing, so why are you here? Oh, I know. You think I was gambling. Is that right? It's none of my business. Why should I care? 
Uh, just listen to me. I saw a friend of mine. He was gambling back there, so I went to tell him he really shouldn't do that. Friends should trust each other. That's the basis of a friendship. Who said I wanted to be your friend? Piss off! Hey, Joan, uh, listen to me. I... Oh. I think she just told you to leave, Look, I just pal. want to talk to her first, okay? Uh, oh! Oh, no. Oh, boy. <laughs> Are you hurt? Are you okay? No, I'm all right. Oh, look, Joan, I just want to tell you that I... I don't want to see you again. Get uh, lost. Yes, Joan! Oh. Remember, Billy, you just have to lose, otherwise we'll lose a lot of money. You're kidding. You want me to lose to a little girl? Billy, my man, hey, you do whatever you can to win this match. Win? Win? Of course he wins. He's the best fighter in the club. How could he lose to a girl? But we'll lose a lot of money. Hey, baby, we can afford to lose, but this is your cousin. Whatever I do has a good reason. I won't need. Here. Be your luck. His arms and legs are long. Staying close, all right? Stay back a little. Watch her elbows. Go over her head. You got that? Go over her head. Yeah. Now, get in with your elbow, and then to a spinning roundhouse. You got that? Roundhouse. You got it? Are you sure you, you understand? Oh, Clary, you're not making sense, Joan. You have to remember. Warning, you can't fight me. Hey! Don't kick him! Come on! 
stool! Hurry up, hurry up. Water! How's it going there, champ? Hey! Uh, done. Put it on. Right, now you gotta see something not going. Oh, he didn't tell me to. I said, put it on. Stand back. Hey, where's my mouthpiece? I'll give him his mouthpiece. I beg of you. Don't fight anymore. Don't fight anymore. No way. Sammy, throw the towel in. Right. No, don't. No. Hey, out of my way. Please don't. No. My eyes burn, Alan. You gotta wash them out, please. Out of my way. Joan. Alan. Just look at you, Joan. You can't fight anymore. Look here. I bet $5,000 on you. I don't want it anymore. Come on. Joan, listen to me. They're low down. They're cheating. They put chili oil on his gloves. Really? Wash my eyes out, they burn. Baby, what are you so upset about? All you know how to do is count all your money. But what can you say about Billy? Hey, baby, I care about him. I hired the best doctor, and he's in the best hospital. The best doctor? That best doctor of yours says his spine's broken. And now Billy's paralyzed for life. What can I do? There are accidents all the time in this dangerous sport. Baby, you know I feel bad. Think I believe that? What about that girl? You let her get away with it? And what am I supposed to do, kill her? I will kill her myself. Huh? Baby, you can't do that. My mind's made up. You arrange it. Boss, your wife's really upset. What can I do? She wants to kill that girl. What do I, put her in the ring and let her fight the damn girl? Oh, yeah. We could make a lot of money if you pair them up. And you know how good your wife is. We couldn't lose. Huh? You're right. You know, it's no wonder I hired you. Now, why didn't I think of that? You showed me up this time. I'll go up now and talk her into it. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Joey, arrange a match. 
I want to fight her. <laughs> huh? Baby, what did you say? I've decided I want to fight with that girl. I bet you put her up to this, goddammit. <laughs> what are you thinking about? How dare you suggest my wife fight that girl? No. It's not his fault. It was my own decision. Baby, if you fight that girl and then you get hurt, well, I... There's nothing to say. Arrange it for me. <laughs> Boss, I... What? Did that hurt? <laughs> I've given you the right to sell the gym. It's all fixed. The lawyer will handle it. Alan, will you make sure the money goes to my mother? Okay. Joan, you don't have to sell it. As long as it's here. Because when patients come to see you, some will join the gym. Yeah, right. <laughs> In three years, only two people have joined. And that's me and Alan. Besides that, we never paid tuition. Still got patients. They're just patients. But after Michael died, the patients don't trust Joan. So there's hardly any patients left. But that doesn't mean you have to sell it. You could do any kind of business here. It's huge. Right. How about the business you're best at? Shall we make it a whorehouse or casino? Oh, that's not what I meant. It's just that this isn't a very well-off district. The students have no place to study. So what we could do is this. Buy some desks and chairs and rent it to the government as a study room. Then we could make enough to pay the rent, can't we? Good idea, huh? Mm. Bullshit. Uh. You're full of it. Miss Lee, in that last fight, you looked pretty good. My cousin's paralyzed for life. I challenge you to fight with me. She's not interested. Just forget it. Just listen to me. You bet 300 thou. That's all that you can lose. But you can make three million. Ten to one. Uh, what's that? Forget it. 30 million's not enough. She won't fight. I figured she wouldn't. It's all right. I know what to do. What? You're going back to China? Yes. I'm taking the first train tomorrow. Tommy, will you take me to the station? Huh? Oh, uh, sure. <laughs> but if you go back, then... Well... Well... I'll give you my address. Tommy, you should go out and get a real job. And then when you get rich, you can come visit me. Uh, uh, oh, okay, I'll do what you say. Hey, Alan, I'll buy you a drink. Don't I have any money? What is it? Uh, uh, I don't know. Again, then listen up. 
What is it that you want? Accept the challenge. Fine. I'll do it. Fight to the death. One round. No gloves. No referee. No rules. The survivor wins. I'll give you the time and location later. Boss, your wife, what do we do? Well, go get her. Yeah, boss. Hmm. Uh, 
Hey, hey, Mr. Wong. There's something you owe us now. <laughs> sure. I'll take it to him now. Hey, how about I save you both some time? I'll send you to see him. Take it easy. You get yourself killed. It's me, boss. Oh. oh no, boss, you've been hurt. Uh. Let's go. We'll send some. Right. Stay here. I'll go look for you. Let me go. No, stay right here. Stay here with Joan. Stay here.
Seems all right here. What's this about gunshots? Well, somebody said somebody heard some gunshots. Well, let's check.